Thank you, guys. Have a great care, night. Man. I'll see y'all soon. Yep. See you soon. All right. Oh, so this is gonna let's... be fun, Taylor. <laughs> All right, here's what's gonna happen. Now I'm gonna I'm gonna run a piss while you do the first hit. I'm gonna do it as quickly as I can because I don't mean to leave you here by yourself. Okay. But I got a piss. All right. All right, go for it. I'll... Then we're gonna then we're gonna fucking double team this thing. Both sides. We're gonna do it. Two a yeah. double just the boy yeah. just just me and you PKN. Oh, yeah. That's gonna be good. Unless what <laughs> what he's gonna show up while you're in the bathroom. <laughs> Change the lane. <laughs> All right. This episode of PKA is brought to you by ExpressVPN. Admit it. You think that cyber... I'm going to do this one slower because there's no one here. Admit it. You think that cybercrime, that's something that happens to other people. You think that nobody wants your data or that hackers can't grab your passwords or credit card details, but you, you, my friend, would be wrong. Oh, Kyle's back. The video is still played on on like mainstream news outlets, and they do not mention that this is fake. No one mentions that it's fake except Why? for like people on Reddit because they don't know. Dude, it took them seven days to get to the bottom of Bernie Gore's. Dude, so, you're uh, right. They are fucking so, idiots. So Matt, so Matt, there's this thing where like um, our, the previous host of the show, um, Wings of Redemption, is this guy that they they goof around on a troll on the internet now. And one of the ways they do it is every time there's a natural disaster, a war, anything big that happens, earthquakes, volcanoes, wars, they take a photograph of him. They create a fake CNN account. So like, let's say it happened like in Sweden. Oh, they make CNN S W N D Sweden. And then they use the Swedish flag and everything. And it looks very official. And then they, they throw something up like this. They say that our boy Bernie Gores was executed in Kabul. You know, I actually think I've seen this photo. Before. So the reason yeah. the reason you may have seen, seen it, this, yeah, yeah. the reason you've made it just make news like the last two days, three days. Big I, news, I, big yeah, news yeah, recently yeah, 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 because yeah. because we're in that age. This guy looks very familiar. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So so he's he's entered a new ring of fame. So like so That's like the, so like that whole. Funny. The, at the at the iceberg, that Wings Redemption iceberg, as it were, <laughs> just just got a little bit fucking deeper and wider. Yeah, because hilarious. Because what happened was, both sides got a hold of this for different reasons. Of course, you have the people who are saying, "Ah, oh, the Russians killed an American journalist. Mm -hmm. Fuck the Russians." Then you have the people saying, "No, don't believe that, comrade. That's CNN lying to you. See, they did it before. They said this guy died in Kabul." <laughs> and you got those people who are mad. And then you got the people who are like, oh, my God, CNN is always like they're they're not on the Russian side. They're, they're just on the side of the truth. And they hate that there's this big lie. And everybody's going back and forth to the point where they had to do an investigative report about this, where two people are sitting at a desk on CNN discussing my boy wings of redemption. Oh, my God, oh yeah. So and, and in the in the comments, like, like they played that. a clip Getting of it. his Twitch stream on CNN. And, and, <laughs> and he was sitting there and he's like playing with his he's like laid back, looking terrible like with his cat. <laughs> terrible. <laughs> <laughs> he's like play <laughs> yeah, there we are. Right there, that's me. And he's <laughs> he's he's fucking petting this fucking cat. And, uh, you know, or whatever it is. And he's, he's just oh like, my yeah, God, that's they crazy. keep putting fake pictures of me on CNN. And <laughs> that's not, he's like, that ain't really me, though. I'm not Bernie. <laughs> In late February, a Twitter account calling itself CNN Ukraine tweeted out the supposed news that an American activist named Bernie had been killed in the war in Ukraine. This got some people agitated because they remembered that in August, a Twitter account calling itself CNN Afghanistan had tweeted that this same man, Bernie, was a journalist who had been killed in Kabul by the Taliban. Now, a bunch of people criticized or mocked CNN for supposedly reporting the same man's death in two different wars, and notably, a senior Russian official at the United Nations used these so-called CNN tweets as supposed evidence of the lies and fakes of the mainstream media. In fact, though, his evidence was itself fake. The actual CNN never tweeted any of this stuff. Both the quote-unquote CNN Afghanistan account and the quote-unquote CNN Ukraine account are total phonies that are not affiliated with CNN in any way. Both have been suspended by Twitter. So who's that guy in these photos? He is a gaming personality, not actually named Birdie, and very much alive, whose name online trolls like to throw on social media during various international crises. The whole CNN article was, it, the, the, the Bernie name is supposed to be racist, it's, and it's supposed to make fun of me. 
it's not the real CNN, it's just some crap people made up on Photoshop. <laughs> I, I...